Biotechnology is really the modern applications of molecular biology. So anytime you're talking about um, molecules, be it DNA or proteins, anything like that, that would really be biotechnology. So, so many things we talk about today in medicine or food science are related to biotechnology. Biotechnology is a combination of pretty much all the sciences. It's also a combination of technology and engineering. To me, biotechnology is a field of biology that focuses on the cell and molecular side of biology. So the technology, from my point of view, is more used for research and investigation, but of course there's also a huge industry out there. Biotechnology is very important because you can't turn on the news or open up internet browser without seeing some new um, finding about biotechnology, DNA research, medical research. Pretty much any aspect of medical research now deals with DNA or proteins, drug research, that type of thing. So really as we push forward the frontiers of biotechnology or of, of medical science, uh, most of it involves biotechnology. It produces a lot of the products that help medical science advance. It's also very much involved in modern agriculture, producing new crops, and it is also a very important tool for research. Students get a very strong foundation in all of the, all of the sciences, all of the biotechnology or molecular-based sciences, in DNA research, proteins, microbiology, immunology, uh, animal care and handling. Um, but then when they finish, the nice thing about the biotechnology program is they can go a lot of different areas. They can go into all those areas as well. So they're not, once they graduate, they're not trapped going into one specific area. They can go into, again, microbiology or DNA research, molecular biology, molecular genetics, all sorts of different areas. I joined the biotech program because uh, I've always been interested in research. Um, my grandma actually died of cancer, and I never actually wanted to be a medical doctor. Um, I didn't find that suiting for who I was. However, I always found the understanding of the hows, whats, and whys of all the you know, details of how things happened in terms of that was very interesting to me. I found the biotechnology program here at Ferris to be very suiting to accomplish those goals. Students in the biotechnology program, uh, four-year program, uh, first two years are general. Uh, they'll take the same types of classes as any um, student in biology major. They'll take a uh, year of general chemistry and then organic anatomy and physiology. And it's really the last two years where the students get into the core biotechnology series of classes. And classes in DNA technology, protein technology, immunology, and microbiology, things of that area. I would recommend biotechnology to future students if they're motivated to do lab work and have the motivation for science to do experiments or medical research. Students get lots and lots of hands-on work in the lab because we really do want the students to come out with smart minds, but also very, very smart hands. Generally we try to make sure that the labs will teach them the sorts of methods that are important in the field and we try to combine kind of what's cutting edge and other things that are maybe just a little bit more instructive. I'd recommend the biotech program here to um, students at Ferris just basically because it's it's a very focused degree um, in terms of it gives you a lot of experience in a lot of areas. You get the best of biochemistry, the best of a molecular biology course, you get all the hands-on labs that you don't normally get you can't normally get with a biology or a biochem degree on its own. It basically teaches you a lot of things you couldn't normally get with just a different kind of science degree. It's a, and it's very applicable once you graduate. You can apply it to almost anything you're interested in. Our biotechnology program here at Ferris is very unique because what you really get at Ferris with biotechnology program especially is, I always say you get a private school uh, feeling at a public school price, um, small classes, small lab classes, small lecture classes, uh, lots and lots of one-on-one -on -one with the professors, um, but yet we're large enough that we do have the capabilities, we do have instrumentation, and we do have the resources that you might not get at a really, really small school. The way that the teachers teach you is very personable, and it's an intimate class setting. So when you do have a question, or when you do have trouble understanding a concept, it isn't a type of situation where it's a classroom filled with students and you never see the teacher, it's a, well, you know, hey, Dr. So-and-so or Mr. So or Mrs. So-and-so, would you please explain to me? And they can do a one-on-one -on -one with you so you better understand the concepts and enhance your learning experience. Once you graduate from the biotechnology program, there's a few options for you. You could go on to a professional schooling, get your master's degree, a PhD. 
You could also go into the industry and work for several different companies. Our past graduates have worked for local companies in Michigan, uh, MPI Research down in Kalamazoo, uh, Dow Chemical, um, some companies in Lansing, several small biotech startups down in the Detroit area. In terms of graduate programs, we've had students go to graduate school or are going to graduate school, uh, Indiana University. We have a lot of students that go down to Wayne State, Michigan State. We have one student who's actually currently doing his PhD at the Van Andel Research Institute down in Grand Rapids who works on cancer research. All the people in the program are really close-knit. Basically, you are hanging out with your friends in the program. Um, so you can ask any questions, you study together, you hang out together, and it's really cohesive. That's my favorite part.